ride from around here Packed up, threw it in a third gear I guess I should've known it wouldn't work out I'm from Wisconsin and being from Wisconsin you kind of grow up either on a dairy farm or you live next to a dairy farm or you work on a dairy farm. A town in Wisconsin is made up of three bars, one church, and one house and that's a town in Wisconsin. And that's where I first really started to hear country music because I never grew up listening to it at all. Uh, I grew up on 80s rock music and 90s pop rock music and working on the farm was the first time I ever heard country music. Uh, which ended up being George Strait was one of the first ones that I heard on the radio working on the farm. Growing up actually I thought I was actually going to be an architect is what I went to college for. I went to college for two years but then started playing at open mics at bars and more and more people started showing up and I thought maybe I could make a living out of doing this. I had the first cover of Cruise on YouTube and Brian Kelly was the one who saw the video first and he reached out to me on Facebook and said, hey man, we got a show coming up pretty soon in Wisconsin. Uh, would love to see you and hang out with you and just kind of get to know you a little bit. Uh, so I went to the concert and met up with the guys and they were just really cool, down-to-earth people. So they've really pushed me in this town, told me to come and move to Nashville and start on a music career. They said I was raw at the time, but to practice and, and hone in on my skills and it'll take off. Since I moved to town, I won $10,000 through Eckridge Music City Sing-Off uh, during CMA week of 2015. Tootsies was having a competition and I ended up winning the grand prize, $10,000, and got to record a song with uh, Grammy-nominated producer Dave Brainerd, which is one of the coolest experiences ever. Dave is one of the nicest people that I've met. I was able to record my debut EP with Dave and Grady Saxman, and things have really taken off since then. My music is definitely a mix of George Strait and Jay Cohen. Uh, George Strait, because of the lyrical aspect and melody wise like just something that always sticks in your head but Jake Owen because of the sound that he has something that I want to roll my windows down to and just stick my heart out to and that's that's what I feel like like my sound is what makes me different than every other young male country artist out there nowadays I feel like is the lyrics that I have to offer people really connect with that uh, I feel like People think country music nowadays is all watered down and there's, there's no storytelling anymore. Uh, there's, no, there's no feeling behind it. People don't really, haven't lived out their songs that they're singing about. They don't know anything about uh, working on a farm or they've never had their heart broken or something like that. Uh, and everything that I've written and recorded is 100% me. The music is all about the lyrics for me. It's a feeling that you get. It puts you in a certain place in time and you can picture an entire event that's happened in your life that you can connect to with the song and that's what country music really, it speaks to me that way. Like lyrics are everything to me. Mm -hmm.